In today's video, I will teach you how to make a photo collage using GIMP. Let's get started. First, make a canvas with the dimensions of your choice. Now, go to the menu bar, Files, and select Open as Layers, and select all the images that you would like to put together. Now, we have to crop them in 1 by 1 ratio. So make sure to take note of the dimensions that you used for the canvas so that you will have a basis on how much to crop your image. To crop the images, go to the toolbar and select the Crop tool or simply press the shortcut key Shift-C to quickly switch to the Crop tool. Now, make sure to enable the current layer only, enable fixed size, and input the dimensions that you want to crop. Now, simply crop each image layers. Hiding the cropped layer is very helpful in this situation to avoid distractions and to make it easier for you to navigate through the layers, especially if you're working on more than four images. Once you're done cropping the image, you can now add guidelines to set boundaries to your images. To do this, go to the menu bar, Images, Guides, and select New Guides by Percentage, which would make the process easier. Now, if you would like to go borderless, simply put a 50% vertical and 50% horizontal guideline on your canvas if you're doing the basic 4x4. But if you're using 3x3, you have to divide 100 by 3 and add them as a guideline. But if you would like to have a border, you have to figure out how much border you would like to have. For example, I would like to add 2% border and 2% spaces in between the images. So go to Images, Guides, New Guides by Percent, and put 2% borders each. Take note that the starting point of the guidelines are going to be from the left and top side. So only put 2% on the left and top side, and put 98% on the right and lower side. To add spaces in between the images, you have to divide the border by 2 and add and subtract the amount on either side. For example, I have a 2% border, so I will have to subtract 1 to 50% of the canvas and add 1% on the other side. So I will put 49 on one side and set the other side to 51. And I'll apply the same measurements for both horizontal and vertical guides. Now, go to View and make sure to enable Snap to Guidelines to make resizing and repositioning easier for you. Now, simply use the Unify Transform tool to resize and reposition the images. And you're done. And if you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.